I thought now, though, uh, since I'm finally uh, back, I'm going to go do something I was originally supposed to do last week. Or at least uh, back when I was streaming Sunday before my internet got taken away. And then right afterwards, I took like a great big week-long break. I was going to do this last... I was going to do this when I streamed it Sunday. Not this Sunday, but last Sunday. And I totally forgot all about it. And as you see, guys, see... Um... I won't, though, Andrew, but I thought I would uh, share off something that I got that was actually pretty cool, though, Avengers-themed. So, as you guys are well aware, though, uh, this, I guess a little earlier this year, though, the Avengers Endgame finally came out. Biggest, uh, biggest blockbuster movie of the year, and I thought it was actually pretty good. I was actually a little. I was. I remember watching Infinity War in theaters about from like last year and leaving the theater feeling disappointed when Thanos finally got the Infinity Stones and did the finger snap. <gasps> spoilers, spoilers. I know. But besides all that, though, they did give us uh, these pretty cool Infinity War cups. Almost all the Avengers on here. Whoops. <laughs> we got Star Lord, we have Rocket, uh, Thor and Iron Man, Groot and Steve Rogers or Captain America, Gamora and Spider Man, and Black Widow and Doctor Strange. And that's pretty much it. But, about a few weeks ago, uh, Avengers, uh, Avengers Endgame was getting another re-release in theaters. Sadly, the, th the movie theater I worked at, we did not get this, though, which kind of sucked. I, I would have, I would have gone for another, for a second viewing of it if I played at my theater again, but nope. That did not end up being the case. But there is one cool thing, though, I did get. Avengers Endgame Cups. Look at this one, guys. Look how bad. Look how awesome this looks. Okay, all the Avengers are here. Actually, now that I noticed it, I don't think Natasha Romanoff is on this. But also, that's not the that's not it though, guys. I also have a second one. This puts a smile up upon my face. This puts a great big smile upon my face. <laughs> Trying to do it as Thanos, and I'm doing a really really bad Thanos impression, and I apologize. Guess what, guys? These are all these are all Marvel, Marvel. These are all the Marvel Avengers. As like, now I used to work at the movie theater for years, and we get like these little figurine things. And I do so happen to have another one of Natasha Romanoff, and I thought I would bring that up because one of these is actually supposed to be Natasha Romanoff. Let's just do these one at a time. We have Thanos here. This is supposed to be Iron Man. I'm just looking at these. War Machine. Hulk. You guys might not be able to see them though because of the plastic, but don't worry. You will once I once I take the plastic off of these things. This one's supposed to be Captain Marvel. And Black Widow. There are a few. A few of the Avengers. Not too bad. I just thought this would be cool. So let's just go open up Thanos one first. God damn. 
Look at that, guys. Look what he's wearing. Yeah, it's the Infinity Gauntlet again. Well, there is a point, though, near the end of the movie where he does get all the Infinity Stones again. And then he finally says, I am inevitable. And then he does the finger snap. But then right after he does it, though, the, th the stones vanish off. To who, though? Just watch the movie if you don't want me to spoil it. This one's supposed to be Captain Marvel. Ah, uh, yes. Captain Marvel. One of the least famous ones now. I think there was that uh, video, like just before the movie came out, though, Brie Larson said something on the internet, and then and then it Rotten Tomatoes of a ratings of Captain Marvel were like so high that right by the time the movie came out, the ratings just disappeared off off of Rotten Tomato. Over something that Brie Larson said. Mm hmm. These are not amiibos, though. Twin towers. Twin hours. I mean, sorry. Scarlet Witch, guys. It's fucking Scarlet Witch. I still happen to have another one of Scarlet Witch, but this was back when, uh, back when the first Avengers movie came out, so we just see her with, uh, with, like, sticks or something, supposed to be, probably supposed to be night sticks in both hands, I don't know. I will, Josh. I'm gonna just quickly do this. This part's gonna be a highlight on my on my YouTube channel, Josh. Hulk himself, Josh. Just stop. <laughs> Is that Beast Boy? It, it looks about me it look like Beast Boy, but no, this is actually supposed to be Hulk. Don't worry though, guys. In, in Avengers Endgame, the Hulk this time is actually supposed to be... This is supposed to be... Uh, this Hulk is actually supposed to be different now. Bruce actually goes through a lot of gamma rays, so he still, so he still looks green like the Hulk. But he still is supposed to be like normal Bruce Banner at the same time. Oh, I'm sorry, Andrew Rocks. I didn't mean to. Shit, I really did, Emma. I really did time. I really did purge all of everything that Andrew Rocks just says. Let me finish this highlight first, Andrew. I'll get you modded again. War Machine. It's War Machine, guys. And probably now the last, most powerful, and also the best Avenger out of all of them, guys. I probably don't have to say it, guys. But, just for old, just for old sake, and just for good old, a 
homage and whatever. But guys, I am Iron Man. Now that's pretty cool. This this Iron Man is actually supposed to be. I'm guessing this is the same one from Infinity War as well. The 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 Iron Man that they did for Infinity War now actually Tony now actually makes a, a nanotech Iron Man suit and yeah actually and if you do watch Infinity War he he hits like the little thing and then all of a sudden the suit finally comes out and covers up uh, and goes right over his whole body and it eventually becomes the suit. I thought that was pretty cool. Right after, I know there's like one mode though where he shoots him over, where, where he blasts out these candidates, and then he's all, and then uh, Bruce is like, "Whoa, what was that?" And he's like, "Oh, it's nanotech. You like it? <laughs> it's all nanotech now." So yeah, this this Iron Man suit is supposed to be completely nanotech probably still is five years after the the finger snap as well so I wouldn't be surprised anyway that's about it these are these Avengers I'm, I'm de de they're definitely gonna be putting on a new windowsill because I had I used to have like a great big I have a I have them up on my windowsill in my bedroom and I'm running out of room <laughs> need to need to go find a new spot now Maybe I'll put some over here on this window right over here. But that's just after the air conditioning unit is out of the way. Anyway though guys, this is the City Camp Gamer. You guys have yourselves a fantastic night and I'll see you guys later.